Hello everyone, this is Kim and I am doing your weekly reading and happy Labor Day to those who celebrate it. First up, let's take a look at what's happening this week and we have the choice card and connection. So we are choosing to rise above disappointment and to connect on a deeper level with people and things that mean a lot to us. And it's this choice that helps us to get clear on connecting to what feels good this week. And you know what? That's okay. It's okay to do the frivolous things this week. It's okay to hang out with people who make you laugh until your stomach hurts. It's okay to watch something that is totally inappropriate otherwise. Who cares? Do what you need to do this week to feel good and to reward yourself and especially if you've been having disappointing times, choosing to connect on a deeper level with things and people who make us feel better is going to give us the relief that we need. So awesome. I'm happy to see that that's forecasted in this week's reading. What tools do we have at our disposal? We have vulnerability and taking off. And like this flower, once you start to open up and be open to seeing what what's out there and risking, you know, possibly getting hurt, the opportunity to get success and love in life is right there to ready to take off. But you will have to utilize the tool of vulnerability to get there. And so this week, you know, you're opening up and finding yourself saying yes to things that you normally would say no to. And you're opening up. Yes, there's risk and exposure to heartbreak, but the takeoff card does confirm a great reward is at hand for you. So you've got to be willing to share and open your gifts and share who you truly are and be your authentic self. You are embarking on a new journey this week, okay? So it's time to be vulnerable. And if this is pertaining to love in your life, it's time to be open to being vulnerable and being your authentic self and opening up. And this, this is pertaining to your passions, your goals, your career. It's time to start opening up and really, you know, taking off some false masks and being vulnerable. People want to see that with you. Finally, what's what's the outcome cards? Confidence and abundance. I'm not mad at that, right? So, you know, after opening up and taking some risk, your confidence is going to grow. And you are going to have a successful week. You're going to be recognized at work. You're going to be, you know, looked at on the dating uh, websites and dating apps. You're going to be attractive to people, both at work and your, you know, if you're a YouTuber, you're going to get a lot of subscribers. So this week, after, you know, you're going to actually embark on a journey of growth and you're going to be confident. And that confidence is going to bring you abundance. It's going to bring you abundance. You're going to attract abundance this week by way of your confidence. But you aren't confident necessarily at the start of the week, at the onset, but by the end of the week, you are successful. You are viewed as a success and you are a success. And like I said before, this confidence is leading you to an inevitable abundance. All right, my dears, have a very blessed and abundant week. Much love. Many blessings. Bye.